G'day, you're out in the desert and you have a shock absorber fail. Now, like any good tourer, you've carried your spare shock. We thought we'd show you how easy it is to change them. So, first thing you're gonna do, undo this bolt. All right, there we go. Now, sometimes you're gonna use a bit of WD-40 or another sort of dispersant material to loosen that bolt off, because they can get tight. They're in the mud and dirt and all of that. All right, so undo that bolt. Now, the other thing is you often find that they're really tight on the bushes. Now this one I've had off, so it, it, it's not tight, but you get a pry bar and you can lever them off like that or use a big screwdriver, pull it off, all right? Now, get your new shock absorber, you've got new bushes, put a little bit of slippery with your WD-40 or a bit of grease on there, not too much. Put that back on, a little bit of dispersant on the threads here, all right, and in she goes, tighten that bolt up. Now there is another type of shock absorber mount which is called a pin tight. Basically you've got a bolt on the bottom here and a couple of nuts or a nylock nut which is a self-locking style nut. Okay, so you can do the same thing. You just undo those and away you go. Now because you're on rough roads, make sure you tighten that bolt up nice and tight. Don't overdo it, but make sure she's nice and tight and go and enjoy the rest of your holiday. I'm Mad Matt, stay safe on the trails.